Okay, um, hello boys and girls, this is going to be a short video of a weird bug I found in Ultima 7. Um, I basically came across this bug, um, and this is meant to kind of be also a response video to Kikasia's Let's Play of Ultima 7. And, um, I came across this to test a theory in response to some comments made on one of Kikasuke's Let's Play. Uh, basically, I read somebody made the comment of, uh, you should properly return Alignora's notebook to him. But, uh, as already has occurred in the Let's Play, and those that have played the game, um, well, no, is that uh, Alignor gets killed by the man with the hook and Elizabeth and Abraham uh, due to the Guardian getting information from the Wisp and killing Alignor. Um, so, anyways, being that um, I come up with my weird ideas, I was going to make the comment and reply saying that Kikaskia could return the uh, the notebook to the corpse of Alignor if indeed the originally murdered corpse was a clickable corpse, which I discovered it was not. But that's how I came across this weird bug. So let's just go on. Uh, and and see. By the way, this um, you can see it's dead there. Although it's missing like the candles and all the ritually uh, murdered kind of extra props. But by the way, this, this save game is right near to the end of the game. This is um, right before you're supposed to go through uh, you know, the Avatar Island dungeon and uh, complete the game. I've done everything except for uh, that part. So it's pretty far into the game, and he's and he's supposed to be dead. And you see his corpse right there, listed as a victim. You cannot click on him. So, um, but the thing is, is he he should be dead. And so I was looking around, but what's this? Uh, we have a sage, so let's talk to the sage. Why is he here in Alignard's, uh, you know, house, especially with his murder? So let's go say hello. Hello again, Alignard says. What? You're supposed to be dead. In fact, your dead body's still right on the carpet in front of your front door. What are you doing here, Alignard? So, as you can see, he's still alive. Now, this is still after you're supposed to have had the answers to life and death. So, I tried to, um, you know, I want to give him back in his notebook. It's proper, you know, it's a virtuous thing to do. Uh, no answers. So... Well, I, I want to return the notebook to you, as I already promised. Yeah, see, there it is, right there. See, and I click yes, just like I did before. Uh, okay, so I've used it already, and uh, which actually caused your death, but it doesn't seem to bother you, so I guess it works fine. Let me do the virtuous thing and return your notebook, which I still have right there. But, as you can see, the, the script for the character right now is still before he's supposed to have died. And he doesn't recognize that we've already taken it to the wisp and, uh, causes his death. So, I don't know. I mean, uh, but, uh, you know, uh, the Avatar doesn't quit. You know, he's a paragon of virtue. He keeps his promises. So, we're going to properly return, um his notebook, just like we said we would. So, we gotta make sure he takes it. Okay. And, um, let's see, now we gotta go here and, uh, 
so we don't want to just leave it lying around because somebody might steal it. People, especially in Britannia, they, they like to just steal everything that's not nailed down. So let's properly give it back to his possession. So there you go. That's how you return Alagnar's notebook properly, the virtuous way, in Ultima 7. I thank everybody for watching this, uh, that did watch this, although I don't know why, but um, again, I want to plug uh, Kikaska's Ultima 7 Let's Play, it's really great, got me back into these games. Um, that's going to be it. Uh, thank you, uh, the Avatar, signing out.